Assalamu alaikum ninjas, welcome back, welcome back. Oh my god, so many uh, so many videos created with the Pocophone F1. I think this is the most popular uh, smartphone on my channel and generally probably the most popular smartphone on YouTube ever. Uh, so we're gonna do an updated uh, battery test here. I'm gonna wait until the battery drops to 90%. I'm gonna do exactly the same what I done with my previous test with the MIUI 9, MIUI 10, uh, Android 8 and right now with Android 9. Yes, this is right now Android 9 updated version. So we're gonna play PUBG for half hour ninjas. You know my battery killer test. This is my specifically unique video which I started on YouTube. I didn't see anybody doing something like this, uh, but extreme uh, also GFX tool, extreme uh, FPS uh, mode enable with the HDR ninjas. Check it out. HDR extreme mode, realistic mode, everything, everything for all of you ninjas. Oh my god. Uh, also, this is the regular mode. Uh, remember the upcoming beta mode, uh, the upcoming version will have the notch enabled. Basically, the notch fix will be fixed. Basically, the notch problem will be fixed with the Pocophone F1. So don't be sad ninjas. This is just using an older, basically the Play Store version right now. I tested also the global version. Sorry for that, the beta version, which the, that does have a, a, a notch fixed. Anyway, wait, uh, let's wait until the battery drops to 90% because we're going to, uh, of course, calculate, calculate from there. We can even take care of the case just for in case, in case somebody says, oh my god, it heats too much if you put the case on. So 24 degrees for now. We can also test the thermals and we can also test just a minute if I can do that. I can go slide, slide again, slide again. If AIDA64 is right, right now working, thermals, I know it doesn't have some kind of issues, bro. Do I have just a minute? Let me see. Still 90%. Don't worry about it. Let's go to thermals. Oh, the here with the thermals here. So per, pretty cool, man. Pretty cool. Very cool temperatures, normal temperatures. Battery 26 degrees. Yeah, yeah, that's completely fine. Uh, anyway, you just watch it uh, till the end because I'm gonna also show you on the end what kind of battery uh, life I had with the Android 8. Remember that. I'm gonna, that's the, also the purpose of this video to show you the small comparison because I already have it here on my Xiaomi Mi Pad 4 to show you uh, what kind of battery life you got with Android 8 before this update. Stay tuned. There we go, ninjas. Also, uh, using the screen brightness is, like I said, with my every single smartphone, I'm doing the same uh, test. Wi-Fi only activated, everything is disabled, and screen brightness is at 50%. Also, the sound speaker is around 85 to 90%, around 85% or so. Anyway, 91% uh, still, still waiting for uh, to drop to 90%. Okay, Ninjas, 90%, uh, it's uh, 1948, uh, so we're gonna play till 2018, Ninjas. Yes, 2018. So that's exactly exactly half hour, check it out. Okay, let's begin. Also, you won't probably, I'm not gonna show you the whole gameplay of half hour, uh, because I don't think uh, most of you will watch this gameplay for half hour. Probably you have uh, something better to do in your life. Since I'm not a pro gamer and I don't know to play PUBG, so kind of an excitement way. Anyway, so let's begin. Like I, test, uh, like I said, also this is the battery test, uh, also the fluidity test with the PUBG and Android 9 updated GPU drivers. Yes, uh, we have updated GPU drivers. Oh my god, this guy is, uh, he left the match. Uh, also, we are testing the thermals, we're testing the heating test, we're testing, the, of course, the, te uh, the temperatures outside and testing, the, uh, of course, the te temperatures of the hardware and then we're going to test the temperatures of the uh, inside, of course, uh, the battery, the, the processor, etc, etc. Check it out, the Beast Ninja is the most powerful smartphone for $300, nothing ever, uh, nothing ever was created that it, it was so powerful for $300, nothing man. Nothing. That, this is why the Pocophone F1 is the best smartphone of all time, bro. The best priced smartphone of all time. Sucker. What a sucker, man. <clears throat> and 
Let's go. I will show you probably temperatures after 15 minutes of the gameplay. So somebody told me that uh, Pokemon F1 has an issue when you are uh, aiming slowly. Where in the heck do you see guys here an input, a uh, long input delay? Where in the heck do you see that, bro? I don't see it, honestly. So I don't know why people are, if somebody has an issue, uh, they kind of generalize that all oh, Pokemon F1 uh, smartphones will have those problems. And just my smartphone doesn't have it. I, like, I said it like already 10 times in 10 different videos, but people still keep repeating, oh my god, you have touch issues. Where, bro? Where? There you go. They said move uh, slower with your hands, uh, with your finger. I'm moving slower, bro. Oh. Damn it. Who was, who was shooting at me, bro? I think they thought that I'm dead or something. I don't know what they... Th I, I don't know, bro. But I think that was the easiest kill that I ever done, man. A double kill. Oh my god, it's even win a win a chicken dinner. What the heck? This is epic, bro. This is epic. See, your ninja is so weird, man. This is strange killing uh, a killer mode, man. Anyway, so let's continue next. Continue, continue, continue. Continue, continue. And lobby. Uh, anyway, let's show you here after 5 minutes of the game, uh, 33 degrees, not bad, not bad, but we're gonna wait until half hour passes. Uh, again, immediately go to the start, immediately go to the start, bro. Not bad, not bad at all here. Again, don't expect, uh, still, even with the Raid 9 Pi, uh, Pokephone F1 is not better than the Black Shark or OnePlus 60 in the game, in, game, uh, in the game, Ignijas. OnePlus 60, it seems that it's overclocked, and Black Shark has that shark mode where it kills uh, all unnecessary uh, apps, all unnecessary process in the background, and focuses all the power of the SOC in PUBG game ninjas. I'm gonna uh, probably have a comparison. I'm gonna have a comparison on my YouTube channel, so you're gonna see by yourself. What did... How did... Oh, okay, I don't get it. Okay, we're gonna unfollow him. Ninjas, this is extreme mode 60 FPS. Telling you, uh, nothing is faster than the Pokephone F1 for $300, uh, even under $350, nothing, nothing. Beautiful, beautiful. Nice, full pack. Just need a West, the vet, the vet, the West. Call me Kanye West, playing PUBG, the vest man. Oh, there you go, the backpack. He doesn't want to take the backpack. Okay. Nice. Okay, let's move on.
Oh, somebody killed my dude over there. Nice! Okay, he's inside. Nice! How in the heck he passed me, bro? I didn't even saw him. Kill, it's a kill there. Okay, I'm only left. Where in the heck is he, bro? Oh my god, he got me. He was waiting there. Okay, Ninja, so right now we are, I think, almost uh, 13 minutes uh, into the game. And oh my god, what a difference. I'm going to still wait for half hour. But uh, remember that with the MIUI 10 Android 8, uh, Pocophone F1 was uh, overheating. It was up, uh, 41 degrees, I think so, Ninja. But right now I have really cool temps. Amazing, amazing, bro. We will see, we will see. Okay, we are back, we are back. Okay. Ah, no weapon here at all. Come on. No weapon in, even in neither here, neither here. Finally, take Uzi.
Okay, let's go, bro. Okay, yeah, nice spot, man. Damn it. Oh, I see somebody there. Damn, he's a he has a nice cop, probably. If somebody just had a grenade right now, he could just throw in this small house. Watchtower. Two left. I can't wait, bro. I can't wait. Let me go outside. Okay, one, <coughs> one dude was just killed, so one more left only. Oh my god, I made these buttons too, too big, what the heck. I think they are too big, bro. Should resize them. Downsize them. Nice! Winner winner chicken dinner, bro. Not bad, not bad at all. Also, still really cool. Oh my god, great temperatures. Ninja's great performance by Pokephone F1 for $300, honestly. Maybe it's not the, be the, the fastest gaming smartphone in the world, but for $300, it's a dream phone. It's a dream phone, bro. Can't wait to get uh, uh, Pokephone F2, inshallah, in 2019 to see what's going to happen. Probably it's going to be more expensive. Uh, I have a prediction that it's going to probably be the pre-sale price will be probably be maybe around $380 to $400. Because I think they're gonna add more features than just I think they're gonna add more features next to the Snapdragon 855. Let me just check here and one minute more. One minute more to play the POC, uh, the PUBG. What I'm I'm also impressed by the heating stability there, the heating. It seems that it doesn't exist anymore. Uh, if it doesn't hit with the PUBG, that it won't uh, hit with the other games, man. At least that was my experience so far. Oh my god, behind me, behind me. Anyway, yeah, that's it. I think that's it. Just a minute, I'm gonna just try to 
load state and that should be it that should be it just uh, 30 seconds maybe 20 seconds more and we're gonna just check the temps here before before i exit pubg <clears throat> Ninjas unbelievable, but uh, almost through the whole gameplay uh, in half hour, same temperature ninjas, 30 to 33, uh, up, so it's below 35 degrees, that's really impressive ninjas. So Pokemon F1 right now with the Android 9, it's even uh, cooler than the Xiaomi Mi Mix 3 ninjas, which I praised a lot the Mi Mix 3 uh, for the heating optimization and the battery optimization. Amazing, amazing. Anyway, let's exit right now here. And let's see what's gonna happen. Also, they're regarding the thermals. You can see by itself, amazing, man. Amazing. That's nothing, bro. That's nothing. 36 degrees, that's nothing. Very impressive. And let's go here. 81% ninjas. 81%. So, oh my god. Oh my god, this is interesting. So, slightly better battery life, ninja. Slightly better battery life here. 81%. And still on, it's still uh, fully on uh, 81%, you can see by itself. Very impressive, so 9% for half hour ninjas. So it will take, uh, if is it 9% for half hour, it will take 18% for one hour ninjas. You're gonna get, uh, you're gonna get probably five and a half hour screen on time uh, playing PUBG ninjas. So approximate, approximate, because so this is a half hour half hour more from the previous Android 8. Uh, Android 8 got maximum five hour screen on time for the PUBG Ninjas. Remember, this is a 4,000 mAh battery inside of the uh, inside of the Pocophone F1. It has a full HD plus resolution. LCD IPS screen, obviously. Very impressive. So good news for all of us. Good news for the Pocophone users. Good news for the people who are discussing which smartphone to buy, Honor Play or the Pocophone F1. Pocophone F1 will give you a better life, battery, better life, battery, better life, better battery life in the PUBG Ninjas in the gaming itself. And this is the proof for you because this, uh, it seems that this, they optimize the hearing ninjas. That's why probably I got right now better uh, screen on time for the PUBG uh, because it doesn't overheat like the previous versions of the Pocophone F1. So unless the smartphones get into my hands, I don't trust to anybody because my tests are right now. So, <laughs> so I, I mean, I'm, I'm not, I'm just saying that I honestly love to do them. And it's very interesting to see these results. What do you think, guys? What do you think? Still 81%, man. Still 81%. Probably you could get even more, uh, like I said here. But again, we're going to still uh, still say as we are around five and a half hours screen on time, ninjas. So I forgot to show you here, uh, just to show you here, uh, there you go, let me just put the full screen. Uh, Pocophone F1 with the uh, MIUI, 10, uh, MIUI 10 Android 8, just uh, f two weeks ago, operative system which I'm having, the, uh, of course the build, uh, the version, uh, it, it took 10% ninjas. This one takes 9% for half hour, very, very impressive ninjas. The same results, the same results. You can check also this video on my YouTube channel for the full uh, in-depth battery test, if you want to check the comparisons. Uh, anyway, this is it. Uh, we'll buy this one using my promo links below. Highly, highly recommend you ninjas. Even from the day one still today, this smartphone is super attractive and uh, the demand is so high ninjas. Even today, man. Even today, after a few months, the demand is so high that you can't believe it, bro. You can't believe it. Pocophone F1. Pocophone F1. Anyway. I said, I'm going to see you till next time. Still 81%. <laughs> Such a great battery life. Such a great battery life, bro. Oh, my God. You know, Banggood and Gearbest, the buying links below. Uh, don't Honestly, uh, like I said, you, you even saw on my YouTube channel that uh, I got scammed by AliExpress and Sunski. Uh, by, so I'm... So from now on, I 100% just reckoning the Banggood and Gearbest. Sometimes if I, if I find some other sites, I will recommend them. But Sunski, no chance I'm going to ever, ever promote Sunski anymore. The biggest scamming site on the planet. Don't buy on Sunski Ninjas. Gearbest or Banggood. The bang links will be below. Beautiful, beautiful. Have you ever wondered where to buy smartphones from? Chicky chicky ching 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 China. That is the gearbest.com and banggood.com, the most reliable two sites for online buying. Use my promo links below in the description to purchase anything ninjas. That's the best way to support me. Let's go!